Stage four of the Tour of Oman started at the Knowledge Oasis Muscat, and it was the knowledge that Jabal al Akdar or Green Mountain, awaited that sent shivers through many. A breakaway group of 10 formed early, no genuine threats in the general classification. The red colours of BMC's Daniel Oss, the best placed overall, more than four minutes behind the red jersey of Edval Bosenhagen. The first three hours of racing, they were fast. Astana controlling the peloton with an average speed of 44.7 kilometres per hour. Stein steals in the breakaway for top sport Vandren. He picked up the first of the intermediate sprints to move to the lead of the most aggressive classification. Once they hit the lower slopes of the final climb, it was Oss that was the last to survive, but he faded. So too did the red jersey of Bosenhagen, who put up a bold yet fruitless defence of his red jersey. The two pre-stage favourites, Vincenzo Nibali and Roman Bardet, butted heads on the climb. Mahal Wikudos and Brendan Canty tried to stay with them, but they just proved to be simply too good. Bardet launched a blister in attack, and it was only Vincenzo Nibali who was able to follow. And then the Italian and the Frenchman rode through to the finish line, where it was an arm wrestle for stage honours. Behind them, the battle was on for the minor placings as Canty and Kudos were racing for the white jersey, whilst Bardet and Nibali were racing for the much coveted red leader's jersey. The climb on Green Mountain being extended from previous editions, an extra two kilometres worth of climbing. Vincenzo Nibali showing good early season form, shoulder to shoulder with Bardet in the sprint to the finish line, and it was the Italian who came out on top. Vincenzo Nibali winning the stage, Bardet in second position. The gap are opening up, and for Vincenzo Nibali, the stage win also bringing the red leader's jersey. He leads the race ahead of Bardet, it's Fulsung in third.